Don't forget, this is an interactive video. Every time you see this symbol, click to find out more. Hi, I'm Darren Kennedy, and I've come to St Albans to visit the Barrow family, who went online and won our festive makeover. I'm here today with my team to give their house a fabulous festive look. Hello everyone, and congrats on winning the Matalan Christmas makeover. Are you very excited? Absolutely, yeah, absolutely over the moon, Bye. delighted. So what's Christmas normally like in the Barrow household? We've got all the family coming round, 15 people, so it's going to be a noisy fun affair. And what's your normal style with decoration? I think um, often it's a mix, so we have something for the adults, try to make it look quite classy, but also um, we love all the Christmas characters and the lights and Santa for the children. Um, obviously the tree is really important so that Santa can come down the chimney. And Daisy, what about you? What type of decorations do you like? I um, have a pink Christmas tree that I put up in my room. So you decorate your bedroom? And a homemade angel. Well, this year you don't have to worry about lifting a finger because I've got my team here and we're going to deck your halls with lots of festive cheer. So what I want you to do now is pack you off for the afternoon and when you come back you're going to have a lovely Christmas house awaiting you. Is that a good plan? Sounds amazing, thank you so much. Yeah, brilliant. Well, I hope you like it now. I feel the pressure's on. Right, well, we've got rid of the family, so time to get my team in and get cracking. So we're starting off, I think, with your Christmas tree. Always, always, always put the lights on first. Because if a light bulb goes or you need to change the positioning of them, for whatever reason, you can take them off easily. My first tip for decking out your home this Christmas is to pick a colour scheme and stick to it. Here we've chosen the classic red and gold. Clashing lots of colours can end up looking really messy. If you want to be on trend this Christmas, and let's face it, who doesn't, then think rustic. Use woodland tones and animal iconography to make sure your home is fashionable and festive this year. When it comes to the dining room table, then more is most definitely more at this time of year. Stick with the colour scheme and pile on lashings of gorgeous tableware. Right, well that is the all-important dinner table set. We just need to light the candles and then we're good to go. Okay guys, I think we're done. Guys, are you ready? Yes. Do you want to come in? Yes, yes please. Come on in. Wow. Welcome wow. to Christmas. <laughs> wow. What do you think? Oh, oh unbelievable. Are they real presents? I love the tree and I love the fireplace. Absolutely fantastic, it really is. Mm -hmm. Love the little figurines, the soldiers, they're beautiful. Aren't they really Christmassy? How about you, Dad? Uh, I love the tree too. Absolutely fantastic. Are you happy with Christmas? Oh, <gasps> the lights! <laughs> <laughs> I love that. And Daisy, what about you? I like the Christmas tree and then candles on Oh, yeah. good eye! She spotted the candles. Well, I have to say, one of my favourite pieces are the uh, silver reindeer. Yeah, really spotted them. Yeah, really stylish, aren't they, Daisy? They look fantastic. We've slightly rearranged your furniture as well. Have you spotted that? Yeah, it looks really good. I really like the room laid out like this. It's fantastic. Which means you've got all this open space <gasps> to the dining area. Oh, wow. <gasps> Mum, you seem very happy, I have to say. Oh, it's beautiful. I love all the red. It is just... I just want to get a turkey out now. <laughs> So that's the Barrow family home made over for Christmas. If you'd like to see how they get on with their wardrobe makeover, stay online and pop over to this week's Cat's Closet. Mm -hmm.